Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. The day is beginning, there's so much to do. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday. Today is Thursday, May 14th, 2020. Um, and I am really excited to be recording this morning message. I have loved getting notes from your families about some super shout outs um, and some of you who are just going above and beyond this week, and I couldn't be prouder. Um, so I'm going to give a few shout outs before I talk about the rest of our morning message. Um, the first one is Ali. Um, yesterday I saw Ali on Zoom and he and his brother created the coolest cardboard like hideaway fort. I mean, it had everything. It had lights and a cat door for Coco and cool drawings on the outside and really creative, um, like a trash chute. And they had kind of like a mural on the wall with all different things that they, you know, that are really important to them and special to them, words that kind of describe them. So it was really cool um, to see their creativity in that way. Um, but then after we got off the phone, I noticed that Ali's mom kind of mentioned to me that um, in their culture and in their religion, um, in the Muslim re religion, um, they are observing Ramadan, which um, is the holy month in Muslim culture. And so um, what their family has been doing has been fasting. And normally they fast from sunrise to sunset. And Ali has um, really been taking that fasting in stride. He um, has been being of service to his family by making his own breakfast um, and helping prepare iftar, which is the evening meal during Ramadan. And he's been, um, his mom reported that he fasted from around 8.30 a.m. to 8.15 um, and 8.15 at night. So if you can imagine, that's like a really tough thing to do, but it's something that's really important to his religion and his culture. And so I just want to express how proud I am of Ali and let him know that we support him and that we think, at least I think, that it is really, really courageous to do, um, to do that at such a young age. So big shout outs to you, Ali. And I know I'm going to plug in my computer and I know that your mom is really proud of you and really grateful for all of your hard work. Um, another awesome shout out that I have is for Ethan. Um, and Ethan has shown such courage and perseverance this week. Um, Ethan was feeling a little unsure about um, posting his science video to the virtual science fair, but he ultimately um, took a risk and decided that he will share it with everyone for the virtual science fair. So I am beyond proud of Ethan because I know how that feels to feel kind of unsure about something, but I am so proud that he is taking a risk and sharing his video because it is awesome. You guys, it is about, um, the ice caps melting and like global warming and climate change and you all have to go watch it to support him um and to support this risk that he took because this video i mean you guys will laugh so hard it's an amazing video and it also is so creative and scientific and i love it so um please go over to the virtual science fair to support him and watch that i'm not sure if the science fair is posted yet but when it is this is a great video. And lastly, Crosby is another friend that I'd like to give a big shout out to. Um, her mom said to me that she's been a star independent student this week and she's really 
um, been an excellent role model. Um, and she has been working on all of her assignments really independently while her mom works closely with her little sister, Grace, on Grace's reading. Um, and so Crosby's kind of been doing, persevering and doing her work and problem solving and doing it all independently, which is fantastic. Um, and reading, writing, and math, she's been doing it all. Um, and she also has been persevering and being a fierce bike rider this week. She's learning how to ride her bike. She fell down, but she got right back up. And so Crosby, we are all rooting for you. And we hope that you keep trying and trying, trying with that bike riding. So keep it up. Um, and to everybody who didn't earn a shout out or like you haven't, I haven't received a shout out about you. Work extra hard this week so that your family will reach out to me and tell me about all of the awesome things that you're doing um, because it's been really special for me to hear about the cool things that you have been up to. So awesome job, Ali, Ethan, and Crosby. We love you so much and we are so proud of you. Um, and what you can expect for today with your videos, I uploaded a brand new math video, just a continuation of what we were doing before, and there are new math worksheets that are up on the website too. Um, and then some of you know the quick math with Miss Maroney, but I also did a, an explanation video of how to access those fun challenge um, problems with Miss Maroney on the math page. And then on the reading and writing page, I did a fun mindfulness activity. So I like to call it Mindful Smith instead of mindfulness. It's just kind of my little the name of what I call all of my yoga and meditation videos, but I hope you enjoy. And let's do the jellyfish greeting. Let's do double jellyfish greeting. So good morning class. Whoop, 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 whoop. Awesome. I love you all so much. Mwah.